Hi, boys and girls, and welcome to today's Read Aloud. Um, again, this is Shark Week, so we are working, are learning about a different shark today. Yesterday was the Great White. Today is a shark called the Hammerhead Shark. Why do you think this shark is called the Hammerhead Shark? That's right. Its head looks like a hammer. That makes sense. Okay, let's get started. Big fish. Hammerhead sharks are big fish with wide heads. Wide, if you look up here, it means um, it's like long. So take your hands and stretch them out, and that means wide. If you look over here, it's showing the size of a great hammerhead shark and a human. So they're really big. They are able to hit like a hammer. In the ocean, this hammerhead shark swims in shallow ocean water. Shallow means it's not very deep. And if you look here, anywhere you can see yellow on the map is where they live. It glides near the sea floor. It touches the sandy bottom. Do you know what the word glides means? What does it mean? Glides. It's like it swims smoothly. It just floats along there. On the move. This hammerhead shark migrates for the summer. Migrates means it swims to other water to get food. It leaves warm tropical waters. It travels to mild waters. On the hunt. This hammerhead shark hunts for prey in the sand. That's a good word, prey. What does that mean? It hunts for prey. Yep, it hunts for its food, the other fish and types of animals that it eats. It cannot see buried animals. However, it senses their presence. It means it can tell that something is down there. And some of the things that they eat are stingray, squid, fish, and crab. We learned that crabs have really hard shells. That was one of our stories last week. So how do you think the hammerhead shark is able to eat the crab even though it has a hard shell? That's right, it could use its really sharp teeth, right? Good. It also looks for swimming animals to catch. On the attack, this hammerhead shark pins a stingray with its head. Then it cuts into the stingray. Its teeth are like saw blades. So if you look over here, here is a great hammerhead shark tooth and here is a human tooth. So strong. Do you see how strong hammerhead sharks are? Would you swim with the hammerhead shark? That man must be very brave. I would not swim with the hammerhead shark. So today you have your two sentences. I would like one sentence um, to be answering the question, would you swim with the hammerhead shark? Okay, so you would say, yes, I would swim with one, or no, I would not swim with one. And then tell me one fact you learned about a hammerhead shark. Thanks for reading with me. I'll see you later.